Hello, good afternoon to uh, one and all. Like you, we are very much ready to go here. And looking forward to a game that has been the topic for universal conversation in this part of the world for much of the last few days. It's dry at the moment, but the forecast has warned us of impending rain. There's no certainty about that, but uh, when it does come, it shouldn't affect the uh, dynamics of a match which has so much riding on it. This one of the great amphitheatres of the game. You are welcome to it, and indeed to one of the grandest fixtures. The Portes Iquique have opted for a 4-4-2 formation. Well, the obvious standout in today's football in this system is that it provides you with extra presence in attack, with many shaky defences about, getting the right partnership in that department can pay rich dividends as long as there's a good early supply so playing two strikers can um, can be a real help to this team in 4-4-2 these days peter gets a lot of criticism but it's it's unfair any system can work if you've got the right players things have got on the way here pretty promptly Nicely controlled. Plays it out to the flank. Crosses it in. And it's hoisted clear. Oh, that's nice. Out towards the flank. Lovely feet. Well, they are working very hard to get it wide now, Jim. Yeah, I think they've decided to concentrate on, on working the flanks to help the production line. It's, uh, it's where the room is. Into the middle. And that's been levered clear. And it's played forward. Forward it goes. No efforts on target is acceptable if levels of enthusiasm and energy are good, and they're not. Defending of the desperate variety. Keeps everyone guessing. It's come loose. Hoists it forward. Gets into a dangerous position. Ah, oh, he's given it away! Oh, well intercepted, really alert to the danger. Tries to get it forward quickly. Decent progress down the left. it into the area up to meet it hoists it forward and he's made sure that that won't get through Forward it goes. Done very well to intervene. It'll be a throw in. A really good feat. Looking for a decent ball in. Time to deliver. Hit into the middle. Great lead! Oh, he couldn't get the direction he needed. 
Universidad de Chile can defend those situations better by stopping the crosser at source. certainly showed brilliant imagination there to take on high tower of skill A wonderful delivery, and all it needed was a touch. Oh, look, it's, it's often the timing of the jump that dictates what you can do with any header, and if you get it slightly wrong, then you'll struggle, but that was beautifully met, it really was. Deadlock broken, it's 1-0. And that ought to be the trigger for a really exciting and entertaining game from here on. Referee's had a look, and he's blown his whistle for half-time. So there you have it, a close sport half of football, but what has still had its moments, but ultimately produced just one goal. A decent game up to now. It's a dressing room that needs rousing at half-time, because in truth, they've not really been at it so far. Um, if the pep talk works, we may see a very different side second half. We need to. We're ready up and running for the second half. The Portes and Kike don't need to press the panic button just yet. They may have to tweak their, their setup first if they don't grab an early goal in this second half. They can't hold back though. Looking cross-field, changing the point of attack. It's a good run down the right. Where could this lead? Defence got the better of him this time, but I'm sure he'll go again. Well, I'm a believer in having faith in your ability, but he's overdone it then. Uh, the ball needed to be better there, it's a wasted chance. Plays it over to the other flank. Almost an hour gone. So, Jim, what are you thinking? Well, the stats are pretty telling here. It's hard to argue with the scoreline when you carry so little threat. Tries to get it forward quickly. And it's played forward. Oh, good interception. Good idea, just poorly executed. to get it forward quickly and again they run up against stubborn defending hoists it forward cuts it out forward it goes that's the throw few waiting for it oh. 
He's had that put on a plate. This is good ball retention, and it should be enough from here, but they want to double their advantage. Universidad de Chile clearly aren't looking comfortable on the ball at the moment. Predictability has just crept into their play. So who's he picking out? Plays it back. That's a tries a shot. He scores. A two-goal lead, and they're firmly in control. That really was a thing of beauty, curled in effortlessly. Well, the ball flight may be unpredictable, but the predictable part was the technique. It screamed goal all the way. Universidad de Chile could not have picked a better time to snatch a two-goal lead. Is there still time for a response? Well, some fans are already on their way out, so that to me says everything, Peter. And that's it. Well, it's ended in defeat and frustration. They just didn't get the breaks. No reward for a very genuine effort. It is a hard one to take this. How would you sum up what we've witnessed, Jim? The Portes de Quique 